Joshua Lou. It feels like a commanding lead, but it's only eight points here. So we'll see if Christian Hong can mount an attack. That's a good start. It's a good punch. Almost scored one judge out of the two. Push for that. So that's very close. Beautiful try. Lou doing a swinging body hook kick. Just uh, give Hong a little credit. Got his hand right in there last second to cover out that beautiful spin. And off the line to the face. Barely. Again, Josh Lou has been executing high, low. Beautiful punch by Lou. Just runs through the front leg of Hong and with great physicality scores the right hand punch to take it to 11 2. So, again, um, it's not a big score, but, but it feels as if Josh Lou is in firm control of this minus 74 kilogram final. Uh, big spin there by Lou. Misses. Looking to, looking to spin. Looking to punch. So he's definitely put his stamp on this match with physicality, with punches, with sneaky inside body shots, and of course, looking for that head kick late. But just not. That's a nice try. Hong, Hong barely misses. So that's the first sign of life I've seen from from Hong here late in this final. But can he, can he add to that? He's got to add some momentum to this. He's got to turn the momentum on this match. He needs to do it early, and he needs to do it often. Again, too much physicality for the athletic Lou, and he'll he's now extended his lead out to 10 points. So, so Coach Shaw asked for is it Kong Jong for out of bounds or for falling, and it's for falling. So he's going to tell him that. So he's going to ask for the blue player to be out of bounds. This could be a stretch, but both I don't think either athlete are disappointed with this challenge, as they're both getting a well earned rest here in the third round. So if you're just joining us, we appreciate it. We, we value your comments, so please give some comments in the box. This is Facebook Live, and this is coverage of the 2021 Grand Prix from USA Taekwondo. And, again, this is the Central Grand Prix, so we're in the Texas, uh, Fort Worth, Texas area. We're going to be in Greenville, South Carolina next week, so you're going to get to log on and, and catch uh, coverage of that as well. And of course, we've got competition this whole weekend. So a lot we want to see tomorrow. It's Saturday. You have time. If you can't be here in the arena with us, then log on and watch our coverage because we're going to have coverage of all aspects of, of our competition. It doesn't matter whether it's boom say. It doesn't matter whether it's sparring, board breaking. Young, not as young, we have it for you here at USA Taekwondo. So, so appreciate you joining us. And again, we're in a video review from Coach Han Seng Han Cha for his athlete Christian Hong.
<laughs> Man, it's rejected, so we're back to action. Third round, 42 seconds left. Blue in the blue with a 10-point lead at 12-2 over Hong in the red. And here comes Hong. He's on the attack, so he's got a little renewed energy. Can he work it into points? And that's a nice job by Josh Lee, just doing a good job of, of Jim. Lou just doing a good job of controlling the distance, and, and he's doing it with good motions, good jamming, and of course, the punch and his follow inside roundhouse kick. So he's hit everything he wanted to hit here. He's really controlling, but that there, there's your distance control I talked about right there. Hong just can't quite reach him, and when he gets just to the distance, he feels like he hit him. Josh Lou's gone, and then the next time he's jamming him up. So it's the distance control of Josh Lou. That's been the difference in this match. He tries to stay in bounds, and he does before the clock ends. So another another uh, athletic move by Josh Liu, and that is your champion. Your champion in the minus 74 kilogram category it is Josh Liu from Colorado. He will win the championship. We hope to get an interview with him. He is our champion. We're going to slide Josh and, uh, yeah, I'm going to bring him over. Joshua, congratulations on your championship here today. So let's talk a little bit about the competition if you have a second. Um, first, why the change from 68 to 74? Um, it's coach's decision. Yeah, 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 I think it's a great decision. I mean, you looked amazing out there. What? What's working so well? Because I feel like you controlled the distance from jump. He couldn't find he couldn't find the range for the inside kick. He couldn't find it for the outside kick. Something you're working on in practice? Oh uh, yeah, we work on a lot of distance and like reactions. So if someone kicks certain whatever kick, then you know you're gonna skip back, go in, cover drills. So I think like one of the biggest things that's improved in my game is my cover and my like reaction. Yeah. yeah, and so my last thing, and I'll, and I'll promise I'll leave you alone because you just had the championship. This is the healthiest I've seen you in a long time. Yeah. And I think that's a big part of it. It, it, it. How do you feel? You just feel good? Feels good to be back and stuff yeah. like this? Yeah, it definitely feels good to be back, like fighting and everything. I had a longer, like, get back because even COVID, but I tore my ACL, so that was another thing. But I think it's just because, like, our WCAP program is just incredibly good watching over athletes. No question, no question. But a healthy Josh Liu is something that we all want to see. Congratulations on a great performance Thank today you. on your championship here at the at the Grand Prix here in Thank Fort Worth. You. You're welcome. Hey, you have your phone?